everyone, it's Tiffany. I am here with the brand new Poopsie Slime Surprise Blind Boxes. It says there are 10 magic surprises inside. I really like the new packaging. It's super fun. It says over here on the side, make unicorn poop. One, make slime. Two, add magic. So sparkly. Three, collect and store slime. So this is drop number three, you guys. I love, like I said, I love the packaging. There are 16 plus to collect. I have three of them to open up with you guys today. And it says we have to start here. So let's go ahead and unroll here. I look like we gotta cut it a little bit. I love these boxes. Anyway, let's go ahead and start unrolling. So we have the unicorn food first. I don't know, are we supposed to grab this out? Maybe, maybe? It looks like they have like a checklist and stuff. Oh, or is it all in here? Or how does this work? I don't know, we'll figure it out. <laughs> so we have the instructions, which we will use uh, because it, I forget how to do things. But it shows us how to mix it in the different types of containers. And I'll just go ahead and set that off to the side. But we do have our new checklist, you guys. Look at this. Ah! Okay, so of course we have the regular rare, ultra rare, and super ultra rare. And we have the usual, the junk foodie duties. Oh my gosh, look how many of these there are. And then if we flip it over, we have the lunchbox lumps. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh man. And then we have the sugar flush. Ooh, lots of really cool ones. Which one is your favorite, you guys? I don't even know. I really, really like a lot of these. I think I just have to see them in person. I mean, the chicky do, obviously. That's a super, super ultra, super ultra rare, so I don't know if we'll find that one. There's tons and tons of really fun ones, and I can't wait to see who we're going to get inside. So I'm going to go ahead and keep on rolling, because I think we're supposed to do that. I don't know if we were supposed to take those out, but look, we got the surprise scent in this cute little, like, french fry box that's so cute and I'm just gonna go ahead and open this up now since you know since I have it in my hands and we'll add that to our slime later and then we have the unicorn magic the uni didn't we have unicorn food already we have more unicorn food I'm confused um, and is that it that's it so now we have unboxed our meal if you will and we have all of these different blind bags on the side. And it looks like we have like a little kind of, some kind of food container in here. I love these, I love this little like addition. Uh, I don't know what's in here. We'll open up some of the blind bags first. So this one, I'm gonna assume it's a mixing spoon, yes. We have a new mixing spoon. It, we have to put this one together so we can go ahead and do that. So it's more spoon-like. The other one we had in previous series was square. That's really cool. We have it's it's more uh, like longer as well, and look at the unicorn's hair. And then we have our cup, which looks to be kind of along the same lines. It's translucent. It's glittery. And then this will be. We do have the sparkle unicorn sparkle, and we have the whatever is in here. So I'm guessing this is the, the little figure, and this is the container. So let's open up the container. Maybe. Ooh, it's golden. Oh, it's a little gummy bear kind of uh, bag. This is so cool. So let's see if we can find it. It's probably in the lunch box. Yeah, the lunch box lumps. This is Tootie Bear, and this one is an ultra rare. So it's going to be. Oh, it's multicolored slime. That's why we got two different two different packets. And then it smells like strawberry jam. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. So the container opens just like this. We get to mix our slime in there. That's so awesome. I love the shape of that too. And for it being hard plastic, it's super awesome. I love this container, how we could totally just reuse it for other things. Like you could use it for like play food for your dolls or whatever as well. And let's get our little bear out. Here he is. So he is translucent and you can go ahead and you can store your slime in these containers. I always have a little bit of a difficult time trying to get these open for the first time. <laughs> Let's see if I can do it. Come on. Oh, I just launched the bottom of it. I'll have to, I'll have to go get that. <laughs> I literally launched it across the room. It hit the other side of the wall. But you can see you can store your slime in there and close it back up. I really like him. He's translucent. He's glittery. And it's super awesome. I'll go ahead and put you back there. So we're going to have to go ahead and follow the instructions on how to mix our slime. So we have our container, remove the lid, we got it, we're in. 
So we're gonna fill the measuring cup to the fill line marked with 10 milliliters and then add drops of the scent to the measuring cup. So we're gonna go ahead and fill this. Is this only one? Oh, do we have to do this twice? I'm wondering, hmm, I don't know. Right, let's just go ahead and continue. So let's check out the, check out the scent. Kept wanting to say slime, obviously it's not slime. So we're gonna add five drops of this. Let's smell it first. Okay, it smells not that great. It actually smells like Flintstone gummies, if you guys know what that smells like. Okay, that was kind of a thing of my, or not Flintstone gummies, Flintstone vitamins, those chalky ones, that's exactly what it smells like. So anyway, so then we have the spoon ready, so we gotta tear open the unicorn. Oh wait, it didn't tell me to add it to the cup, did it? Nope, slide the top part of the spoon into the bottom. Uh, tear open one unicorn food packet and pour the powder into the bottle. Use the deeper portion of the bottle to add contents. Okay, so the side with the label, I got you. All right, we'll start with this unicorn food. Let's go ahead and add it. It looks like we have some really pretty pink powder there. So we're gonna go ahead and add that in. And next, we need to make the slime. So we're gonna hold the bottle with one hand, or bag, I guess and pour the water from the measuring cup in and use the spoon to mix it for one minute. Fold the slime over itself and mix all the water until there are no more lumps in the mixture. Do not shake. Okay, all right, this is different. This is very different from what it used to be. So we're gonna go ahead and mix, mix, mixy mix. And we're going to, you know, mix until there's no more lumps. It seems like it's already, it's like really lumping up right now. So, I mean, I guess we'll just mix it. The next step is actually going to be remove the spoon and close the lid on the bottle. Let the slime sit for 10 minutes. So I guess I'm just, I'm just, how long am I supposed to mix this? For one minute. Use the slime, the spoon for, yep, okay, I'm doing it right. So anyway, it's now starting to come together, which is nice. I like it. And so, what, 10 minutes off to let this set, but we'll go ahead and jump into the other ones while it does set. I'm wondering, open the lid and remove the slime. Open the keychain and store, clean the bottle, and and repeat for your other unicorn food packet. So we're going to be doing two rounds of these. This is kind of crazy. And then we'll see. Should I stop? Like, it seems like it's setting now. I think I'm going to stop. Um, I really don't know. Do we need to close the, 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 the lid? I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to go ahead and wipe off the spoon while it's still fresh, and I'm going to kind of clean this bit off because when we cl when we close the lid it's going to kind of get in the way so anyway closed it's a really nice hot pink color we're gonna go ahead and shut this no we're not we're gonna shut it this way and we're gonna let it set so we have all of the other supplies here unicorn sparkle food scent all that stuff I'm just gonna kind of make a pile while we open up the next one so this is like a big project because it's double the slime each time oh that rhymes double the slime each time we have unicorn food we have whoa we have the scent we have magic actually wait no do we only get food for wait a minute no, I think we're gonna get two foods. Um, then we have food again. And is that the end of the line? Yeah. So now we have all of these bags and stuff that we need to take out. Let's get all this fun stuff out. It feels like we have like a cup this time. Instead of bag shaped. I really like the interesting shaped one. So let me just set this off to the side. And we're gonna start opening everything. So of course we have our surprise scent. And then we have our sparkle and food and magic and I think it's an empty container. Oh, there's more food. And this is our spoon. And it looks like we got a golden spoon this time. Woohoo! I love it. I like the new spoons. They're nice and like nice and long and nice for mixing. And then we have the cup. Whoa! <laughs> We had the cup and it flew away, but we have it. It's still here, we got it, it's right here. It's an orange one, I really like the color of this actually. And then we have our container. What is it going to be? Oh my gosh, this is so cool. It's a snapple, like a, a not a snapple, sparkle. <laughs> and this is peachy 
Peachy is a ultra rare. I'm really excited. We got two ultra rares so far, and they're both in the lunchbox and lumps. So this either is going to smell like peaches or gummy bears. We're either going to have one of these two swirly colors. I'm really excited. I hope it smells like peach. This is really cool. I love it. I love it. Feeling peachy. And then we can just we just open it up from the bottom here. I think it's twisty. Yep. And let's get our little peachy friend out of here. Maybe. There we go. Look how pretty. Oh my goodness, you guys. This looks so stunning because it's just like the, the metallic-y and then it ombres as well. And again, you can take the bottom out and store your slime in there. But I'm not going to do that because I launched the last bottom. But you get the point. And I like the glittery top there and the eyelashes. So pretty. All right. Let's get to making this slime for sure. So we're going to need to follow the same steps. So fill up the water there and we need to do the scent. So I'm really crossing my fingers that it is a peach scent. What do you guys think? Leave me a comment down below. Is it gonna be peach? Let's hope. It's peach, it's peach. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. This is probably my favorite scent of all the Poopsie Slime Surprise, I'm not even kidding. Like I just love peach scented stuff and peach flavored things and peach is just my favorite. Like I love peach tea, I love peach, just peach everything. So we're gonna go ahead and open up our first unicorn food and it looks like we have a peach color which is really awesome. All right, we have peach, look at that. It matches the bottle, it's so perfect. And what we need to do is just pour this in and we're gonna mix, and my cat's here, hi Em. And we're gonna just mixy, mix, 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 mix until, you know, it doesn't need mixing. And then we let it set. Look at that, it looks so good and delicious. <laughs> it's starting to set up a little bit so that we'll be able to, I'm wondering why we're not shaking it this time. I'm fine with that, but it just seems like we should shake it. Oh, because it's in the same type of bottle, but like at the same time, I'm fine with not shaking it, like 100% fine. I like mixing. Mixing is more fun. <laughs> and I think it's so cool that we to get two things of slime now. It's just crazy. It's I'm just I'm just shocked and I'm excited. And I don't know, I'm just I'm just really excited and shocked. I think that was good enough. So we're gonna go ahead and put the lid on or the bottom on, whatever. I guess we technically could have shook with this one. And I think I'm gonna leave it kind of on its side just because we already, like it's kind of at the top a little bit and we just don't wanna, we don't wanna mess with that. So we are going to be moving on to the next one. And then we'll go back around and then redo all of the, not redo all of them, but do round number two for all the slime. But I'm really excited to see which one I put in here. Let's see, all right. First up, we have the food. That peeled off really weird. Then we have the scent. We have the magic. We have more food. All right, all of that. And then we have the blind bag. There we go, all of it is out. And we are in business. So let's see, where's the scent? Let's get the scent out. Scent done. And we have, okay, obviously I have a package there. And then we have a spoon. I'm gonna say it's silver. Oh no, we got a gold one. <laughs> All right, we got a golden spoon. Another one of the golden spoons. Then we have the cup. This one's a red one. I like how we got all different colored cups. And then time to open up the container, which is different, which is amazing. And it looks like we have another bag version. This one's Poopitos, yes. So this one's actually from the Junk Foodie Duties and it's Nacho Poo and this is a regular one. So we lost our uh, ultra rare streak, but that's okay. This one is either gonna smell like that candy or that candy. I would say like Smarties or a Jolly Rancher kind of thing. That's what those look like, I don't know. And then those two different types of swirls. I love the bag containers, they're just so fun. And then we're gonna go ahead and get our little friend out. Oh my gosh, it's so fun. It reminds me of a fish for some reason. Is it supposed to be a fish? I don't know. <laughs> it's really, really cool. I love, like I said, I love the metallic color. 
and it just looks this one in particular when it hits the light it just looks like it's a few different oranges but i think it's just one solid color orange it's like when the light hits it it's a lighter orange and the shadows are a darker orange so anyway let's go ahead and start making this i am skilled professional right now so i know how to make it i don't need directions <laughs> i don't need the instructions no, i'm just kidding we will check out the scent next so with these scents being both candy i'm not sure if i'll be able to tell the difference but i'll let you know hmm this is kind of like a perfumey candy it's really interesting i like it though one two three four five there we go Five drops of scent, done. And we need our first food over here so we can put it in our little chip container. And this is the deeper side, so we're gonna go ahead and put it in. It's a purple color, look how pretty. I can't, the bag is not opening, there we go. So we got pretty, pretty, pretty purple. We go ahead and add this in. And then we're gonna start mixing. It seems like we get so much more slime in these bagged ones because there's so much less space and it's much harder to mix this one because you don't want it to spill over the edges like this one is definitely getting harder and harder to mix um, but it's okay we'll get it this one yeah this one I should I should have mixed a little quicker because it's uh, very lumpy because I didn't it's fine it's fine we'll fix it um, <laughs> but it's coming together it looks really pretty I love it I love it so I'll just, just mix really quickly and like try to get these lumps out of here. Shouldn't be too difficult. I think it's starting to come together. There may be a few lumps in here that I can't get out, but no big deal. Oh no, we spilled over the edge a little bit. It's all right. <laughs> yeah, I have some big lumps in here. This one, like you kind of got to act quickly, more on the quickly side rather than the slow side like I just did. Oh no, we're spilling over the edge. This one is not working out for me. All right, let me get my little paper towel here and let's kind of clean up just a tiny bit and then we'll start going through these guys and um, checking out the slimes that we have made and starting our next round, which is crazy. I can't believe we, we have so many things to do. So first up, we have our gummy bear friend over here. We're going to go ahead and get our slime out. Look at this. Oh my gosh. So wait, 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 wait. Are we supposed to get the slime out and then... So wait, do we add the magic now or wait till we make the other slime? Uh, store the slime and then clean uh, clean the bottle, which we're not going to do because we're rebels. And <laughs> then we add in the... Or we make the next one. And then I guess we add in the magic and stuff from there. So, whoop, that one ran away, okay. Come back, slimy slime. I'm gonna go ahead and put it over here. It's very sticky still, oh no, oh no. Okay, well we're gonna set it there. We're not gonna, we're not gonna touch it. Now I have stuff all over my hands. Let's go ahead and repeat the steps and I'm gonna add in the food. Gotta add in the food. Go ahead and get that. So we have a blue. This is really cool. It's going to be kind of like a cotton candy almost. <laughs> um, let's get our water here and we're going to mix. So like I said, I'm not really going to worry too much. Oh gosh, now I'm starting to make a mess everywhere. <laughs> I just spilled it all over the place. Oh no. It's all right. It's coming together. It's fine. It's great. I, uh, yep, we're good, we're good, everything's okay. I do like the blue color. I like how it's gonna be really like that hot pink and then the blue color, and it's gonna just look amazing when it's all swirled together. I love how we get to swirl slimes, it's so much fun. And I can't wait to check out the peach one. That's my favorite one. You guys will have to let me know your favorite in the comments down below. I think the peach one is my favorite though. All right, so this one seems to be mixed pretty well. We're just gonna go ahead and let this set, let this kind of simmer over there. I have slime all over my hands. And I'm just gonna clean up just a tiny bit and then we'll be back to check out the peach one. So I'm back ready to take on the peach project. <laughs> so let's get this slime out of here. This slime looks so pretty. I love the peach. So we're gonna go ahead and it smells so good, you guys. Oh my gosh. So this one's a little more difficult to get this out of, but we'll get it out, we'll get it. We'll get it. It reminds me of taffy. I don't know, taffy, like, cause it's so stringy and weird. 
And I know it's it, we've had enough time in between sets, so I don't. I think we just need to add in like the magic and stuff, and it'll be better. So we're gonna set that just on the ground there because that is the best we can do for the time being. And I'm gonna try to get the remainder out of here. Oh, it smells so good, you guys. I can't even. I can't even express. So we're gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna use this cup. We're gonna repeat what we just did with this. Well, I lost my scissors. <laughs> there with what we just did so we have ooh, this one's an orange so that's really cool we get i'm making so many messes i was doing so great i don't know what's happening uh we'll go ahead and add this in and we gotta mix we're gonna mix quickly because in this one you can easily mix quickly oh gosh i'm still making a big mess okay maybe mix a little less quickly <laughs> i don't know <laughs> i'm trying there we go, all done. And we're just gonna let that one set, let it simmer, set and simmer. And we'll see how it turns out. That's really awesome. And then we're gonna go ahead and check out the last one. I might wanna clean up my mess just a tiny bit. <laughs> just ever so slightly. Um, this is our other one and it is the purple one. So this one will be easier to get out because you know, it is the bag container and I'm just going to set it on the ground there while we kind of collect up the rest of this here and ta-da! So I'm going to go ahead and start making the next batch. This is our last batch and then we're going to get to check them out and mix everything together and it's going to be super fun. So let's cut this open. It looks like we have a pretty pink. I really like this pink. We'll go ahead and add this in. It kind of reminds me of the peach one a little bit, but definitely more pink. And we'll add this in, and then we have to mix as quickly as we possibly can because it's it's just really hard to mix with the bag one. I'm dri it's dripping everywhere. It's okay. It's all right. It's okay. Just slow and steady. I just feel pressured for time just a little bit, but uh, once it starts hardening a little bit, it's easier to mix quickly since, you know, it won't completely spill out the sides. Like, you know, like if it were just water. So that's great. And we're just going to mix and mix, mix, mix. Like so. And you've almost got it. I think it's, there's still some lumps. Still some lumps. I still don't have this down to a science, but at least we we've, we've got the basics of it done here. Uh, I need to let these set for 10 minutes, and we will be back to add in all the magic and the sparkle and mix them all together. We are back with our set slime. We're gonna go ahead and start with our middle friend here. I need the spoon back so I can get this lift this out. So our steps are as follows. Let's read the instructions. So after we repeat, remove the slime from the keychain and work together with the second slime to swirl the colors. Hold the slime or place it on a protected surface. Add the unicorn magic. So we have ultra rare packets. Add unicorn sparkle and crunch in this step. So we are now going to add, well, we're going to get ready to add both of these. I'm going to go ahead and open them because I know once I have slime all over my hands, it's not going to be that easy. So oh, this one didn't open all the way. So we are going to be adding this in. So let's get this swirling going on. Look at this. Ooh. All right, so I think it's swirled quite enough right now. So this is set up pretty well. This reminds me of Play-Doh. That's kind of like a texture that it is a little bit. So I'm gonna go ahead and create it a flat surface and I'm gonna go ahead and add in the magic as well as the sparkle. I'm not gonna add all the sparkle yet. Um, let's just go ahead and see what this gets us, where this gets us and whatnot. So, oops, I made a big mess. Whoopsies. <laughs> anyway, it's gonna look pretty. It's turning purple now, so the swirl kind of is going away. Um, we are also getting a very pretty shimmer look to it. We got a lot of mixing to, mix to do here, but it's starting to come together, if you see. 
Look how pretty this purple is. It's so gorgeous. Oh my goodness. I love it. It's so nice. All right, I'm gonna kind of leave it not completely mixed because I like the little bits of swirl of the pink and blue in there. And we're gonna go ahead and I'll move this off to the side while we check out our peach one. Let's get this one. Oh, I probably should open up the packets. I can't forget that. I'm gonna go ahead and get this slime out of here. It is, it's, it's in here. Let's go ahead. I just like flung slime on my arm. So here we go. Let's get this slime out. Come on. Come on there, slime. Come on. <laughs> Perfect. All right. Now, I don't want to mix my precious peach. I love it. But we got to. We got to. Um, this one also has the sparkle, which is fun. Is it what kind of is it the same sparkle? I low-key don't want to add the sparkles. It's the same purple chunky sparkles, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna just see what this turns into. I don't know what color it would end up being. It looks so pretty. My peach color is going away. <laughs> but let's go ahead and it swirled a little bit, so we're gonna add in our magic here. We're gonna mix this together. Let's see what color it's gonna be. It's more so orange now. The orange is really taking it over. Uh, maybe it'll get a little lighter as we continue to mix, especially with the sparkle being worked in. I think, yeah, we're starting to see a little bit of a lighter orange, but I really do like my, my peach color, rip, rip peach color. <laughs> it's okay, it's really pretty. So compared to like this dark orange, hot orange, hot orange, neon orange, that we had, it is much lighter, but it's also not as peachy colored as it was. And you can add in the Sparkle Crunch, it would add in purple chunks of glitter, which I don't know if I like that for, like I kind of wish it was a little bit different, like maybe like white chunks of glitter for this one, that would be really pretty. But anyway, this is the one we got, it smells like peaches, it smells delicious, I love it. And then, moving on to the last one, let's go ahead and remove our pink slime. This one came out quite nicely. And we're gonna swirl it together with our purple. So this, this, the purple one was our chunky one, I think. I think, was that, was that the chunky one? Anyway, we have just magic for this one. This one would probably be nice with the unicorn sparkle, but anyway, let's go ahead and add this in. And we're gonna see what it turns into. I really love the color. This one's like really, really sticky. I don't know why it's being sticky because it came out quite nicely and it wasn't sticking before. Anyway, I really like the color of this one. Like a lot, a lot, a lot. The pink color that it is. It's kind of turning more purple as we go along, but it's really, really pretty. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to mix all of these colors together. And I want you guys to leave me a comment down below and let me know what color you think it's going to turn into. So this is kind of our final color for this one. It's a really pretty pink color. So I'm gonna mix, oh, that one. I'm gonna mix these two and I'm gonna add in this orange. So I want you guys to leave this comment right now, pause the video, leave a comment, whatever, and let me know what color this is going to turn into. So we're gonna mix, we're gonna mix. <laughs> this is gonna smell crazy as well. I like, I like the color that it is, like how it's swirled right now. It reminds me of like sherbet ice cream. Let's keep going. I don't know. This kind of seems like it's gonna be a brown color. I don't. I don't know. Maybe a, a weird, a weird pink purple color. I think it's gonna be like a brown purple. Like it's just. It's just like a. It's weird. I don't know what color is this. <laughs> Leave me a comment down below and let me know it, one if you got the color right and two let me know what color this is. I think it's. It's definitely like a chewed bubble gum color. Like, I kid you not. This is the kind of like the wad of bubble gum you find underneath a lunch table or whatever. <laughs> anyway, that's what, uh, that's what all these slimes mixed into. Leave me a comment down below and let me know which of the three different ones we opened up today is your favorite. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.